Hello everyone, welcome to my Project Ideas channel. Today we will learn how to make an automatic sensor tap using Arduino Uno. So let us begin. So for this, first of all we need one Arduino Uno, one micro servo and one PIR sensor and a few connecting wires. Now let us see how to connect the circuit. So first of all let us see how to connect this micro servo. So it has total three terminals. First is a ground terminal that will connect to this GND pin of this Arduino. Second one is the power terminal that will be connecting to this 5V pin of the Arduino. And the third is the signal terminal that we will be connecting to this 3 number pin of the Arduino. Now let us see how to connect this PIR sensor. So over here as well th there are total 3 terminals. First is the ground pin that will be connecting to this GND pin of the Arduino. Second one is the power pin that will be connecting to this 5V power supply of the Arduino. And the third one is the signal terminal that will be connecting to this 2 number pin of the Arduino. So in this way our circuit is ready. Now let us see how the code is there. So this is our code. Over here first of all we have included one library of servo. After it we have declared one object of it. And after it we have initialized one uh, one variable to 90. Now in over here in void setup function we are beginning the serial connection with 9600 bits per second of speed and we have configured the pin mode 2 of the Arduino Uno for the input purpose. After which we have attached the servo to the 3 number pin of the Arduino using its object and initially we are writing it to 90 degrees. Now in this loop function we are reading the value from this 2 number pin of the Arduino and storing it in this variable named as presence. After it, we are printing the value of it in the serial monitor. And we are using this if statement to change the direction of the servo. If the presence value will be 1, the direction will be at 0 degree means the tap will be at open position. Else it will be at closed position. Now let us see how actually it will work. So for it, I am clicking in start simulation. As you can see, initially there is nothing over here and hence it is in closed position. Now as you can see if my hand is near over here somewhere, it is in open position. So in this way it will work. Thank you.